The Torah is not a history book. It's not even in chronological order. The Torah is a guidebook for life. Each phrase, each letter, and even each musical punctuation mark holds within it layers of teachings applicable to each and every one of us, from the most learned scholar to a small child. This week's Parsha Bala contains the well-known Pasuk, Matovu Ohalach Yaakov Mishkan Isaac Yisrael. How goodly are your tents, O Yaakov, your dwelling places, O Israel. The question is, Rashi comments that Bilam, the Moabite king, was amazed when he saw that the openings of the Jews' tents in the desert were not lined up one with the other. What is significant about the opening of their tents, and what can they teach us? They reinforce boundaries and respect. The tents were placed specifically not lined up so no one could see into another's tent. Not only must we have respect for and honor the boundaries of others, we must also respect ourselves and create our own personal boundaries. Some examples of how we can do this, we must take care of ourselves by properly eating and sleeping and drinking enough water. We must determine limits of how much we can give of ourselves to others so that we don't get burnt out. We must respect ourselves by avoiding negative self-talk and by creating healthy boundaries around ourselves, not to let negative influences from the outside in. Your life is your own. Respect yourself. Create healthy personal boundaries and limits. You determine who can see into your tent. Good Shabbos. Thanks for all your support, and don't forget to subscribe below. Take care.